Hi, this is Muniba Faiza from Bioinformatics Review. Today we are going to install Gromax on Ubuntu. We already have a, a tutorial published in Bioinformatics Review written by Mr. Tariq Abdullah. And this article, uh, it shows two methods uh, to install Gromax, easy method and the regular installation. So let's begin. Let's go to a, our folder where we want to download and open a terminal. Here, first we will update and upgrade our system. And here is close my password. Okay, it's updated and then now upgrade. Yes. The easy method, it's uh, uh, it's you just uh, for the easy method, you just have to download the installer file from the repository of Bioinformatics Review, and then provide it permission and then run it. And for the regular installation, you have to install each and every package by yourself. Uh, I I will show you both both of these methods in a bit once it's just done upgrading. Okay, so it's now upgraded. Now let's install cmake sudo apt get install cmake okay so it's pre-installed and uh, when you are installing for the first time uh, you can check for the version okay it's version 3.10.2 let's go for easy method first just copy this command and paste it here it will download the installer file provide permissions chmod plus x installer let me see what's the name okay what's the gromax okay now dot slash Gromax installer.sh it will take care of the rest. Let's enter Muniba. Email address is Muniba at the rate bioinformaticsreview.com. Yes. Okay. Now it is installing. Uh, it will install all the packages by itself. You don't have to do anything. Just wait and watch. So it is downloading regression test tar file. You will then extract it. And then install it. By itself. Okay, now it is installing the main Chromax tar file. Now it is going to make run some tests. Okay, it looks so good so far. Okay, so the Chromax is installed on your system now using the easy installation method. This whole process takes around 5 to 10 minutes and also depends upon the internet speed you have and now let's go for the another regular installation for this we will install the latest version that is 5.1.4 uh, now let's install this build essential first okay my password here it goes okay i because i have already installed this so and it is updated and upgraded now let's okay now remember this path you will need it later okay now we will install the regression test uh, you can either go to the website here you can download from here or you just use this command and remember when you are using this command because this is 5.1.1 replace it with 4 okay and then it will download 
this calibration test i have already downloaded this here okay now we will extract this uh, regression test file so enter this command tar xvzia regression test okay so it's extracted now and we also need this fourier transform library so again go back to the terminal paste the command okay it's updated and upgraded since i have already installed it and then we will install the main gromax file you can either download from here and uh, as i explained earlier use this command paste it here and don't forget to change the version okay and then hit enter and i have also downloaded this one also already so it's here now after downloading again untar this file tar xvzf pro max okay it is showing okay fine everything is going well now enter into the gromax directory gro Oh, sorry not this one let me just remove these two because we are done with this okay okay sure delete it i'm sorry all right go back to the terminal cd space pro max uh it's 5.1.4 okay ls now make a build directory mkdir build okay enter into build now we are going to copy whole this command and paste it here always remember to change the version and put your pwd path here and remove the quotes from here and hit enter okay check you can either add sudo or not it depends on you and now it will take a few moments to finish okay so this regression test is done now let's get back to another command which is sudo make install <coughs> password okay that's done also now let's source this pathway okay now let's check for the version okay it's gmx pdb to gmx voila so it's done your latest version is installed on your system if you have any query you can always email me at muniva at the rate by informaticsreview.com and you can always visit our website that is www.bioinformaticsreview.com and you can like our facebook page for latest updates and subscribe to our youtube channel thanks a lot